They befriend people that they're gonna kill. What did that take? She was forced recon before we got her. Fucking pipe hitter, this girl. You'll do. Get packed. Everyone breaks. Not me. Yellow, this will be fun. She's in. Linus tells the story of two members of the Linus engagement team. A lioness is handpicked to do a really sensitive mission. It's about these women that are in the field. Trained to build relationships with the females around the target that the United States is going after. Asmar Ali Amrohi, one of the leaders of the Iranian-backed militia in Iraq. He is the target. Who's my mark? Daughter. Cruz is this young girl who, for lack of a better phrase, has nothing to lose. So no family. One brother dead, one in prison, if you call that family. She's recruited to help bring down a terrorist organization from within. She gets recruited by Zoe Saldana's character, who is Joe, to be a part of the Lioness team. And she goes on this really riveting, exciting, maybe a little bit heart-wrenching undercover mission. What is that? Way move now! Taylor Sheridan is the showrunner. It's like, the guy knows what he's doing. Taylor is a brilliant writer, and he creates the infrastructure for a character. I think authenticity on a project like this is, is everything. You try practicing CQB in the fucking CQB house instead of the damn living room. You had to have someone like Taylor to write the show, and not only does he just write it, he's like, oh, well, we're gonna put you through Navy SEAL school. <laughs> I want the people that watch this show to say, oh, okay, they did their homework. To get to come in and work with, you know, on this level, the best of the best. Obviously, it's Taylor Sheridan, and we know what he brings, but we're bringing in the best military advisors, the best wardrobe, the best hair, the best makeup, just top to bottom, and then to get to come to all these exotic, romantic locations. We have to go to foreign, interesting places around the world because the story takes place there. The locations are almost like a character in themselves. Let's swim out to the sandbar. How far out is it? Swim. Hey, Joe. What the fuck are you doing? I think I'm having you snatched. You never can tell it is a Monday, Kyle. I think that every government and country has to deal with the reality that you got bad people who are trying to hurt you. In order to protect your country, you're gonna have to have some equally bad people to defend you. That ends up getting into some ethically gray areas. What really happens after a drone strike wipes out a dozen, two dozen people? Taylor said something really powerful. He said, this is also a love story. The show explores love, loyalty, duty, freedom. Sacrifice and resilience. Service of country and service of life. The main theme of this show seems to me is the price of life. Taylor is one of the best at being able to show all of that and make it this real feeling thing. I chose to protect my team and the sanctity of our operation. I think it's just like kicking ass is what they just told me. Fans should expect from this series a suspenseful, nuanced look into the war on terror. There are twists and turns that you would never see coming. If you love Taylor Sheridan shows, this is the best of the best. We're showing you the Shadow Warriors on the front lines, the folks out there that guard us while we sleep. This show has constant action. and romance and deep layered characters that are really fleshed out. I don't think it's like anything else that you'll see on TV. She's been snatched. You should expect a hell of a ride. <laughs>